I'm not gonna lie. There's something about the Wii U that I really miss, you know? There's just something about how it was a simpler time where all we wanted was a, a Wii with HD graphics. <laughs> That's really all it was. Hello everyone. My name is Kevin, but you can call me Beepo, and today, yet again, August 26th, 2021. Oops, I started a YouTube video on my phone while I was trying to check the date. I'm serious. August 26th, it's right there on my computer, and I don't even look, I, I never look at that. August 26th, 2021, and I am playing more fe 7 because like I've said many, many a times, it is my favorite game of all time. And I want to show it all to you. I've played ahead a little bit because I've used my Elliewood hard mode run um, to play with my friend, uh, to play ahead a little bit so I can keep eye on the stuff that happens. As you can see, I'm already on chapter 18X. Oh God, it's loud. Oh geez, my TV. Um, but we were back on chapter 17, so we're going to Whereabouts Unknown, which is a chapter that I actually really like. And although it seems like that's the chapter that's coming up, isn't isn't it? Well, not actually. Not quite. There's a few maps in between, actually. Hector and his allies now march toward Castle Kaelin. However, many Lao soldiers await them inside. They begin their assaults to liberate the castle. So this was right after what happened in the last part, if you remember. Looks like there are still a lot of Laos soldiers in the castle. Lindis, where are the castle Kaelin guards? I think about half of them were killed in the surprise attack. The survivors must be here somewhere. They're probably locked away as prisoners. Right, well, let's find and rescue them, too. I wish we had more power to make up for the poor numbers. Hold on, Grandfather, we'll be there shortly. Time to get inside. Let's reclaim the castle. The key to victory is seizing the throne. That's the tutorial me talking there. <laughs> I do love rotating out of it. So the fun thing about what I'm doing with my Hector mode is I'm actually trying to not use the other lords because I want to keep them low level. So I got to remember that that's eight there and Hector's at 11. So whatever Hector's at, they only have to add eight. It's actually not going to be hard. I just got to make sure that all their levels are below level uh, 50. Level 50 total. So I'm going to try to just mainly use Hector. Um, it would be nice because if I get them to level 10 and 10, if I get them to level 10 and 10, at least you're only at 40, but you got to keep them below level 50. Um... And in the Elliewood hard mode, I'm max leveling, leveling them. Because there's a point where you get a, a level, there's two different levels, and it's based on what level your lords are. So we're going to be doing that. But on this playthrough, I guess I'm using Kent more so. Yeah, we'll just bring Kent. Because I am definitely not bringing Marcus either. We can finally drop Marcus. Oh, jeez. Um, and I will use Will in this route. In this route. I guess I... Do I want Rebecca still? Yeah, Rebecca's still okay. She's still actually fairly high level. <coughs> Excuse me. Lowen's level 9. That's a tough call. Because Oswin's doing well as well. Um, but I could drop... If I was to drop Lowen... Oh, I need to bring Priscilla, though. I am, like, required to get Priscilla. Um... I don't really feel like using Lowen, because Lowen should be friends with Elliewood, right? Like, that's kind of the, the thing. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's do that. I kind of like this setup. Um, let's get the items figured out and then we'll move people around. Um, when I, one thing I like to do is if I know I'm not bringing people, they have the give all button. And we can definitely plan all this out. Although, they didn't need to give all either. Lynn, you can take back your mini cotty because nobody else can use it. And Ellie would take back that rapier. I'm sorry I did that to you guys. Um, okay. Priscilla 
I am bringing, because I have to bring her, um, she's just going to have a meal. A, a, a heel, a mend and a heel came together and they made a meal and it was delicious. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm going to grab an extra mend because I'm focusing more on Sarah. She's already level 12. And we do have a guiding ring coming up that we can grab to max level her. Definitely bring Matthew. Um, might as well bring Guy for a bit because I'm, I'm not hating him. He's doing okay. Although, if I were to switch out Guy... I'll switch out Guy later. There's definitely better people we could switch him out for. He's only level 8. Is there anyone who's kind of, like, just a bit better? Not really. Although, I guess, you know what? I would prefer leveling up Florina, though. Because this one... Yeah, I know it's kind of a weird choice. I'm going to drop Guy for Florina, but... Um... I'm actually going to... On this map, I kind of want to go for the speed, although there are a decent amount of archers. Anyway, take a javelin. The heavy spear won't really help you, but because it weighs a friggin' ton. Um, horse slayer? Oh, that weighs a lot, too. Um, what is your con? It's pretty low. Florina's is garbage, isn't it? Four? God, she's dainty. Yeah, she's useless. Oh, my God. Uh, take an iron lance just so you can have... Take a, it's going to drop your speed by a ton. That's the problem, right? I believe it's con, or is it strength? I'm trying to remember how it works. Um, well, we'll look over that in a sec. I think I can check that. Um, it's attack speed when I do attacks. Um, I'm using will for sure. Did I buy any steel bows? Not yet. Okay. That's okay. That's actually not that bad. Um, I want this iron blade to go to... Well, what's Ken's constitution? Oh my god, this is I'm this is taking a lot. Eleven, so that iron blade is actually like really good on him because Matthews is only seven. So transfer. You can take a better sword though. You can take like a steel sword. You can give back that iron sword. Give back one of those lock picks so you can actually like hold stuff. Back, give back both those lock picks because you won't need that whole one. Um, you have a steel sword and an iron sword, and that's all you can really get because the iron blades. The Iron Blade's funny, actually. So I will keep that on Matthew. What's up, Matthew's level? 11? That's not bad. And you still have that killing edge. Give it to Matthew. He'll waste the last few uses on it. Um, Hector, on the other hand, you are going to be taking out of here um, a Steel Axe, just so you can have it. I'll rather Bart work his way up to using that Steel Axe. Or Hector. Hector's about to get there, so he's going to take this silver axe for now. Oswin, you've got the silver lance. You look fine. I'm okay with all of that. Yeah. And Kent, you are going to give the hand axe back. The hand axe back. The slim lance. You're going to instead take the heavy spear and an iron axe. Uh, you need a ranged weapon. You're going to give the steel lance and you're going to take a javelin. Um, yeah. I guess that's it. Sarah's going to trade with Will for a Volnery. We're not going to use Priscilla too much. We actually just need her to unlock... Although, I guess I... No, because I do want Lucius. And if I want Lucius, I need Raven. And if I want Raven, I need Priscilla. That's a pain in the butt. It's a pain in the butt now. That's a pain, pain in the butt now. That's a pain, that's a pain in the butt now. Okay, so check map formation. I also gotta look over what my pairings were, because I had pairings I was planning out too. And I actually have them saved on my computer, or on my phone. I can look at them. I didn't set a timer either. I'm so sorry. I mean, this is gonna be an extra long one today. I always said 55 minutes. That's how we do it here. Um, switch over to my drive. I can see this file. Luckily, it's the most recent thing I've been looking at. My apologies for keeping everybody waiting. Everyone look at the screen before I actually show you the map. I'm sure everyone was waiting patiently. Um, oh, yeah. I was going to have Hector hang out with Matthew. And Sarah's going to hang out with... Oh, I said Sarah's going to hang out with Sane, and I didn't even end up doing that. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, we're not using Sane now, so I can change that. 
Who else? Okay, so we gotta do one more thing. I am so sorry, everyone. I know I'm keeping everyone's time here. We're just gonna do a quick save there. But you know what? We don't talk about this enough. I have to plan out my pairings here because I wanna do new stuff. I feel like whenever I play through this game, it's fun to plan different support conversations that you haven't done before. I can do Lucius and oh, Lucius and Renault and stuff. Like it's time to get that one done. That's gonna take forever. Um, but anyway, no, we're planning, uh, I've used Farina. It was Farina and Fiora, which I got close to, but I didn't get it. Um, sorry, who was I looking at? Uh, Sarah. Sarah. Where, she all right, what? How blind am I? Right there. Oh, she's already done same. Why was I going to do that again? Um, if I'm bling, if I'm blinging Florina... Oh, he can, she's gonna hang out with Hector. She's gonna hang out with Hector. There we go. Who did I say Hector was gonna be friends with? Matthew? Oh, no, it's Sarah. It's Sarah. I was gonna say Matthew, but it should be Sarah. Uh, and Hector. And then, who else do I not have with Sarah? Sorry, I have to check one more time. Who else do I not have with Sarah? Sarah can also hang out with Oswin, so whoever gets him first, I guess. And then Hector can also talk to Oswin. Oh, I don't have A rank with Austin. Oswin. We could maybe do that with Sarah. But I also don't... I'm not really using them. I have so many B ranks, and that's the worst, because you have to play through the whole game again to get an A rank. Because you can only have five total stats. Although, if they die, they can start over again, which is decent. A decent option. Well, I might do Hector and Farina, because I haven't really done that before. Or, yeah, okay, well, we'll work on just Sarah, Sarah Oswin and stuff. Um, anyway, back to the chapter now. I'm sorry, it saved everything I did. It just has to, you just have to rewatch that again. Um, we won't worry too much about this. I was just thinking about how they were going to move and stuff. I wouldn't mind Florina getting that last hit on a guy going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can get to him. Um, but I want him to, th I would rather you throw, to be honest like throw a thing anyway um we are using bart and we're using matthew matthew's gonna hang out with somebody i don't even know anymore i was just looking at it and i already forgot priscilla you hang out in the back because we don't really need you sarah's here 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 to heal that's the words i wanted to say those are the words that i wanted to say let's do it this mission's not even that hard. Oh, should I change what the art is on the background? Maybe a little bit, but it's okay. We can change it later. Beepo. We can't count on the captured Kaelin soldiers to be able to fight. Yeah, I know. They're not good, but if we save them, they're worth something. This is the most important part of the map, is up here. There's Raven in there, along with Lucius. And uh, don't worry, he's going to come out and stand right here next turn. Um, but if we want to get Lucius, we first need to get Raven. And to get Raven, we need to talk to him with Priscilla. So that's the mission here. Um, let's just do it. Let's just freaking go now. Let's take him down and beat him up and beat them up. And bam, beat them up and beat them up and beat them up, beat them up and beat them up now. I don't know why I want to beat them up. People so bad now. Let's go. We oh, man. Oh. oh. <laughs> Matthew, that's my guy. That is my guy. That is my guy right there. Kent, you're gonna just do a charge here. Cause we gotta get, I wanna get there as fast as possible. Cause problems, the longer you take, those green guys are gonna get let out at one point and then they start running by and Raven just starts killing them. So you gotta, we gotta get there fast. Um, lower this guy's health. Good shot, good shot, good shot. That's what I like to see. Um, I guess Osman can get this kill. He has to use the Silver Lance, though. Doesn't he? He has to do it. Bam! Now I gotta move Will. I wanna move him to this exact square so he can trade to switch his Javelin to there. And then you Iron Bow this guy. Yeah, you get XP for that. You get XP for that. That's all that mattered. That's all, the only reason why I did that. <laughs> it's for the XP. And then you run there and you're going to throw your hand axe at him close range. Whoa! <laughs> okay, we didn't need that, Hector. But I appreciated that you did it. 
Good job. No levels I gotta, no heals, no, oh. Well, here you go, Priscilla, your first friggin' heal, here you go. I turned off her animations, because the heal animations, I'm not a huge fan. Um, let me just make sure that's set right. Everyone's animations that I care about are on. People I'm using, I put a two on. Like the people I really care about, which are like Hector, Bart. I guess I do care about Sarah, but she's off right now, because she's a healer. Yeah. That's okay. Um, you know what? I will turn Sarah's on and keep Priscilla's off. How about that? Burn. <laughs> and then Florina just needs to stand right there because in that way this guy can't reach her. And then you come standing right there. And I'm going to quickly try to change the background while I let the enemy turn go here. So here we go. Well, first we have a cutscene. Hey, you. Let me out of here. What? Marcus Ostia's brother's among your enemy, right? Uh, let me out. And I'll help you. But I must have the brother. I have a score to settle with House Ostia. Do you think me a fool? You work for House Kaelin. I cannot trust your word. Then I'll have to break down this door and go through you. You were using Lucius as a hostage, but now he's here with me. Uh, no, Lord Raven, you mustn't. You cannot betray your debt to Marcus Kaelin. Shut up, Lucius. You think me foolish, but you don't understand. How about it? Very well. Y y you get out. Remember, if you betray us, your company dies. Oh, I see. Just remember... If that happens, you die next. Uh, wait. You can't go alone. It's too dangerous. Lucius, stay here and be quiet. I'll be back for you. Lord Raven. Wait, I'm a, I'm a boy, aren't I? Oh. Okay, that's the enemy turn. Now I can switch. That's okay. Matthew's doing okay. Let me just go to this image file. Let me just start moving it. Oh, well, we are in the castle scene, but I would like to try something else. What is that? It's the town scene, I think. Looks like the town scene, yeah. There we go. That's what we're in right now. It's that. What's the other side of this one look like? Oh, it's the throne room. Oh, I like that more. That color scheme looks nice. There we go. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Switch it back. Everything's still going. Recording. I love this setup. It's actually really chill. It's quite vibin', if you'd ask me. And then just in time for the enemy turn, and then my turn, my turn, my turn, my turn. It's my turn now. Um, yeah, we get these archers out of the way. And then I'm not super worried about uh, things attacking Kent. Kent, you're looking good, though. You're looking better than Marcus. Even getting level up still. Look at that, level 2, finally. Skill and a defense? I'll take it. Where are your stats looking, by the way? You have pretty good skill. You're like skill... Speed and defense. And even stray. You got a great spread. Great spread, dude. You're looking great. At level two? Oh my god. Oh, you nearly died. Don't worry. This is what Sarah does. Nice heal. Matthew, can you hit this guy? and not kill him. That will do eight. I'll leave him at one. And then I know who's going to get that kill. I know who's going to get that kill. I I know who's going to get it. I know who's going to get that kill. It's going to be uh, Florina. Ah, ah, Florina. Let's go. Red drop. <laughs> His jump is just so aggressive. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> And I soar in the air. 
I gotta be able to kill that guy though. That's the next problem. Will can definitely one, two, three, four, five, but that doesn't get there. Um, and then you could shoot over. I guess you would have more damage. You're gonna do a strength 14 with the jab alone, so that's 18 total damage to his defense of five. So you do 13 and you do seven plus six, which is 11 minus that five is six. It would kill. Um, so I want, I just want to make sure you get this kill. You can use any weapon. And just, if I am. I haven't really used her much, and I feel like she'll catch up fast because she's fairly low level. And if you keep getting level ups like that, I won't complain. Yeah, you don't double, but Will's gonna just pop. Ow! So then it comes down to what what I'm gonna do here with Rebecca. If Rebecca attacks, she'll double and she will kill him. So because that's the safer option, I'm gonna do that. As soon as she gets hit. That's okay, because we'll do the attack back. Do that attack back. You even double. What the heck? Oswin. Oswin. What the heck? <laughs> Why don't you double, man? What the How high is your speed? Oh, I didn't I didn't show off the attack speed stat yet, but we'll go over that. I'll explain that in a memento. Anyone see that movie? Memento? Great movie. It's one of those movies you can go back and watch and be like, whoa, there's so many things that I missed. Oh, it's a good thing you dodged. I didn't even pay attention. My apologies. I was I was texting and recording. I'm the worst person. I know. I know. So what I do here is you do it, see, for example, you see at the bottom there it's AS. That's your attack speed. That is your like speed based on the weight of your weapon. Right, it's so you take your speed stat, like I have a speed of six. Oh, let me, let me find an example of this where it works. Um, so you see Matthew has a constitution of seven and the iron blade here, this is the best example, has a weight of 12. So because his constitution is seven and his iron blade has a weight of 12, it's five more higher. Even though he has a speed of 17, right? And if he attacks with the iron sword, you'll see his attack speed is 17. If he attacks with the iron blade, his attack speed goes down to 12. His attack speed goes down to 12 because it's 5 less. And the, you subtracted 5 because uh, of how much more weight it was over your constitution. And that's why weight is such a big deal. And there is a wep there is an item that will help with that. That will give you some better... Uh, there is a way to increase your constitution, but there's only few items for it. It's a very useful stat because of that, though. Um, there are some very heavy items... Because like, if you think about it, right? Because the Iron Blade, its big thing is that it has a might of nine as opposed to a might of five here. It does nine more damage, but it weighs a lot more. It even misses more. It's not particularly great, but because it's a D rank weapon, you can still use it fairly early. It's even better than a Steel Sword, um, but weighs more. It's like, do you want one more damage for a little less hit and it weighs a little bit more? But if you can deal with the weight, it's it's technically the best sword you could use at that rank, right? And there's like better weapons. Anyway, um, I'm getting long-winded on that one, let me tell you. Um, let's get some men's going. 
Gotta get the men's going, gotta get the men's going, gotta get the me, 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 me men's going. I'm gonna have Matthew. Matthew's gotta fight this man over here. You have full HP, right? Yeah, okay. Let's draw him out. We're gonna have Oswin come back you up. Um, we gotta get Priscilla up there fast. So Priscilla's gonna charge up. Florina's gonna try to get some experience here. Bart, can you help with that? Because if Hector's there, Hector will help a lot. Oh, you got it. Good job, Bart. I wanted him to get that experience. I, I mean, I also wanted Florina too, but I mean, I'm okay with this. Bart hits level 10. He is ready to class up. Remember, to, to class up, you have to be level 10 or higher. Uh, I, ha I didn't actually mention that yet um, in the Lin tutorial mode. But you know what? When I play Fire Emblem, I'm just trying to play it for fun. I don't want to look at this as like a tutorial type deal because that's where I get too into my own head about the YouTubes, and that's my problem. I might have run Kent a little too far forward, but I think he's okay. He's just dealing with the archers. Because they're not even worth that much experience when you think about it. Oh my god. Oh dear god. These guys are coming down fast. Um, Priscilla's got to catch up. And that guy doesn't have a javelin, so he won't move until he's like engaged. But he's going to be engaged with you! Which Kent luckily will not kill, which I'm actually sort of okay with. It's actually kind of what I was going for. Because he's going to get, like, locked there, and then he can fight his way out. And we can get the Axe Boys to catch up. And the Axe Boys are Hector. Oh, baby! Doesn't kill him. But he can attack one more time, so he's definitely dead. He's definitely going to die. So he's actually safe now because of the way they've all decided to set themselves up against him. It's a good thing he killed that knight because he would have been blocked. A 66% chance to hit a 13 damage from this shaman coming in with a dark magic. Does not hit, unfortunately for him. Matthew's about to level up, so I, want, I would love if Matthew got this kill. You know what the nice thing is about Kent taking a ton of damage as well? He gets healed. <laughs> so luckily they haven't... Oh, Raven's moving. Oh, hell yeah. Thank God Raven moves. That's a good thing. That is the best news I've had all day. Um, today was the weirdest day at work. I don't, I don't know if I can really discuss much of what it is. It wouldn't really make sense out of context, really. But it was just one of those crazy days... Um, there was an inspector there today that came out. Well, first I was late. That's the first funny part. So I had forgotten, like my friend texted me and he said, yo, take this shift. Uh, it was on behalf of another friend, actually a friend that, or another coworker rather, but he's a nice guy. I don't, I don't want to be like, oh, he's not my friend. Um, I won't use any names, but regardless, um, my friend who is also my coworker, but he texted me to be like, yo, take the shift. And it was like at least two weeks ago. It, it feels like it was forever ago that he that he even mentioned this. Because I remembered it in the moment that it happened. Like, I didn't deny it or anything. But I was like, oh my god, that was two weeks ago. That was my excuse. My excuse was like, man, that was two weeks ago. I forgot. Like, bro, I can't remember what I did two days ago. And you told me to take the shift two weeks ago. And they didn't even update it on, like, the schedule or anything. So I, I like, I had looked at the schedule multiple times. And I had, like... It hadn't been updated on one of them. It was a pain in the butt. So anyway, so I'm getting a call at 7 in the morning, which I didn't actually notice. And then I see another call at 8 in the morning being like, yo, nobody opens. And I was like, oh, shoot, I didn't realize I was opening. And I forgot. And then I remembered that like, oh, yeah, today's the day that I traded. Oh, shoot. Right. Oh, God. And then, uh, yeah, so then the guy I traded with, who, remember, is my coworker who um, I don't want to say isn't my friend, but I guess we don't really hang out or anything. But, I mean, he's an okay guy. My coworker, who I was covering the shift on, shift on behalf of, despite me having not talked to him about directly doing this, he texted me and was like, yo, he's... Um, he showed up as well. We both showed up at like 8.30, 9 o'clock-ish. And... 
and then just ended up working. He went home early, though, because he was like, well, I guess I'm technically the opener. I'll go home at 3. And I was like, oh, okay, whatever, because I could use the hours, so I stayed for... I stayed a bit late, but because then <laughs> uh, an inspector showed up, and I had to hang out with them, and it was just it was just odd. I'm actually not going to use... I am going to hold on to this door key. You actually... This door key is very useful. And you'll see why. Oh, well, thank God you did not double. And then Raymond's going to be right in range next turn. What a dumb... What a dummy. Now, the problem is... Oh, that... Oh, that thief comes out of there. Oh, so we didn't need that door key at all. Why would they even give me that? They didn't even need that door key. Because of that level up, right? Because of that thief right there. Uh, because he's going to move up, can I just keep you in Sarah's range? Because you can definitely get... He's going to move to at least there. And you can go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, you can get there if he moves 5 squares, which he should. There's no reason why he wouldn't. Because there's an unlocked staff down there. That we got to get. Um... I have also got to send Osmond back now. We can keep Will, honestly. We can keep Will down here. Because there's going to be a spawn that comes right here, and they're going to go right for Merlinus, so you got to protect him. Because this is actually the first... If you didn't do the bonus mission from visiting that village... Um, yeah. You don't get Merlinus until now. But luckily, we got him early because we did the mission that lets us get him early. Come on, Bart. Yeah. The 77% hit chance. Gotta love it. This chapter can take a bit, honestly, but I do not mind it all that much. If you shoot him, you don't, nothing really happens. Florina, if you go in. So because Florina only has a con of four, and notably the Slim Lance has only four weight, um, it doesn't reduce her speed, even though she has a fairly decent speed. Oh, and you would think that you would hit with the Slim Lance every once in a while, but then you don't. Because I gotta run. I gotta. Well, I can't charge him yet. Okay, so I won't charge. I was gonna charge with them. Um, with Kent, but I guess I can't. I guess I can't yet, because I gotta. We gotta get up to stop that friggin' thief, man. These thieves are gonna take these, and those are good. Those are things I wanna get. And my thief's all the way down here. Can you not kill him? No, you have to. Okay. Here I go. Good job, Heck. What the heck tour was that? I don't know. Just get him, man. Slap him with that axe. Let's go. Uh, we're going to have to turn off animations after this, I think. Oh, he ran that way. Oh, and he goes that way. He's only going to have time to grab one thing, but... You're not going to double. Let's just break this iron bow, finally. If you were going to double, I wouldn't have done that, but you can only attack once. You, had, you have to have four attack speed higher. And, yeah. That's how you double in this game. That's how you double in this game. I'm going to create... Why did I attack him? <laughs> That's Raven. He's about to attack that man. Okay, so Raven's out. We gotta get him there. Sarah, can you heal somebody before they all go running away from you? Because that's very important. Okay, animations are going off now because not much is else. Not much is else is happening. You heard me. Um, you're going to hold that. Raven's got to go this way because Raven's got to talk to Lucius to get him. Um, Bart's going to come up as well. Osmond's going to go down here to help out Will. You're going to grab that Hero's Crest because that's the good item. That's okay. That is alright. 
Ow. Stabbed. Stibbity. Ooh. Stibbity. What? Stabbed. Oops. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Shoot. I didn't just make a restore point. That one just showed up and left. That one didn't do anything. <laughs> I just showed up and left. Oh, God. They're coming out. Bring them out. Bring them up. Bring, 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 bring them out. Bring them what now? Bring them out. 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 Yeah. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring bring, bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring, bring them out. Bring, 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 bring them out. What did you get? A hammer? It wasn't worth it. I wish he killed that guy. Because he fricked up, man. He fricked up. <laughs> Together we ride is the dumbest shit and it's what makes Fire Emblem unique. <laughs> oh man. Good times. And in here is an unlock staff, which is quite useful. Because that is a staff that will unlock doors, and specifically doors, which I won't need right now, but we'll use them eventually, I think. I hope. So now I just got to make sure I throw away the hammer, because I can't use it. We're going to use the heavy spear instead, I think. Oh! See? Infinitely better turn. Now, unfortunately, I can't get there, but I can at least block that thief from escaping. And if I block the thief from escaping, um, he's just screwed, so, yeah. Um, you're gonna hit this guy with a hand axe if you actually hit him, but you didn't. But you freaking didn't, but you didn't. But you did not hit him, no, no, you did not. No, you did not hit that man, no. No, 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 you didn't hit that man, no. The music gets me way too good. I, and I'm sorry that I... Well, I don't want to say sorry. Like, it's fun for me. Like That's what Fire Emblem is. It's like I'm sitting here taking my turn. And I sing through my turn because that's what helps me... Like I don't even have to think about what I'm moving because I, I have such an understanding of this game's mechanics. Um, that And I've played it so many times that like I just kind of know what I'm doing. Yeah, see, there they are. Right on bloody time, they is. I forgot to give him the horse slayer. But we can we can hold. We can hold out for Matthew to get over. Someone should head back, but I don't know who. It would be cool if it was Kent, but Kent needed to block that thief. Yeah, Raven's okay. Raven's alright. Leave Raven alone. Leave Raven alone, no, no. Why would you take that night crest? So if I kill this guy, I get the night crest. Cause whenever a thief pilfers a chest, you will grab the last thing they they took. So we don't get that silver sword. In fact, we can't get that silver sword. I don't think, unless we steal the knight's crest first. I think. Um, but I'm gonna stand there just to block that. Cause I think our thief could steal it, but at this point, there is no point. Right? Oh my god, you have damage on you? Holy shoot, okay. Hold that javelin. No! I like double tapped, bro. Oh man, that's so dumb. Can you kill him? Can you hit this man? You won't die. But I could do like raven attacks, because I'll make raven safe. Oh, sweet. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so now nobody else matters. Um, everyone else can run back. We can use Florina to, like, ferry people, but... We gotta send some people back. Oh, I, I'll just send Bart back, because there's no reason to send back anybody else. 
The Knight's Crest is good. There's no point in waiting for the steel, so I'm just gonna kill him now. There's no point waiting. I can't even kill him in one hit. I'll try to get his attention first. I gotta clear out some of these guys anyway. You have four damage each, really? It's a sizable amount of damage. Can Rebecca shoot this man? You do double, but he won't die. So let's not do that. Oh, well, we need Sarah to get this heal, because it makes more sense for Sarah to do the healing. It'd be cool if you could block that, but you can't. Oh, that sucked. I can't believe I messed that up. I misclicked that at the bottom. If I have to roll back, I'll roll back to the... Oh, sweet. Doesn't matter. <laughs> they don't even hit him. They don't even hurt him. Oh, never mind. We're good. Okay, Kent, you didn't need to show off that hard. I let you get all those kills. Nice. Oh, none of them hurt him. Okay. That's good. So now what we gotta do is we gotta make sure those guys stay safe. So what I like to do is I like to rescue them. And luckily they move last, so... Hector needs to be here, turns out. Hector needs to be here because Hector's gonna need to grab one of them. Bart's gonna head back though, just in case. Sarah's gonna come up, can't heal anybody, just stand there. This is the man that needs to die. Good damage, but he doesn't die. You come in with the iron sword, hits for exactly 15, and we take the... Could have blocked him again too, actually, but I could have held him there for like an infinite amount of time, but it's okay. I'm happy with how this is playing out. Um, you can all just stand there like that, because I don't want Priscilla to get too much experience. She doesn't need it, that's why. In case they really go for him or something. I should have made a safe state there, but that's okay. Well, I should get through this turn. I don't know how it's going to... They're going to start going for Merlinus. He's surprisingly dodgy. That's the very important thing about him. Is He's surprisingly dodgy. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. <laughs> well, at least I can do some things differently here. Let's get this out of the way. Let's open this one first. Just because it's faster to get out of there afterwards. Will is still going to stand here. But he's going to stand in a slightly different way. Um, I'm going to move Kent hopefully enough squares up that it'll go a bit better. Oh no, I, that would, would have been the turn before I would have preferred that, but that's okay. Oh, I can't believe that. It's so sad. That is so sad. Because I wish he was up one square higher, but he is not. Bart's going to start heading back, because he's not fighting anything else. Hector's got a hand axe, so he can fight in different ways. Oh, I did it again! Why do I keep doing that, man? I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. Okay, so now they get let out. Whatever, he's holding that hammer now. That's just, that's just the way it is now. Turns out I don't even need to hit that yet. Oh, but he needs that javelin, man. Frick. Just the worst thing. Let somebody else get some experience at least. I'm rolling with it. It's fine. 
So I can block him next turn. He's going to grab the other item. Before he leaves. I'm going to part back now. Now you're going to drink the Vulnery. And you're going to open that. So you unlock and unlock. Yeah, you heard me. Um, Priscilla's going to move along to help with the rescue efforts. Rebecca's going to back up there. Will's down here. Whatever. That way Kent won't farm the experience off of these dudes the same way. Which I'm okay with. It's actually like he's going to survive better without the javelin. Now we know that Raven doubles that guy, which is good. I like going into a flat note after that. It's just hilarious to me. Um, so we're creating a restore point now. So that's fixed. You're going to go that way. How much damage does he do to you? Oh, and he doubles. Holy crap. Okay. Now you just back up and get their attention. Uh, Florina needs heals, and Kent needs heals. So Kent's just going to run it and just take this guy out this time. Right? Or can I block him with... I can block him with that. Perfect. And then you'll block here. Just hold that iron sword out. It's your best bet. I don't want Hector to cap levels too quick, but he is the only lord I'm using, so I'm kind of... And a speed and a defense? Like, I'll take it. I'll take it any day, bro. It's any day, bro, with that fire emblem flow. Gotta get it in and take it, and then I'm... That's just why I wear it. Fergalicious. <laughs> Fire it. F emblemicious. <laughs> emblemicious. <laughs> That's a word, right? Yo, don't, don't mess with me. That's not a word. You telling me that ain't a word. Yeah, so you're the only one who's going to get hit there. And you can hit him without getting hit back. Oh, stop. Hey. You stop that right now. Okay, we gotta watch those guys now. So we gotta make sure the more of them you keep alive, the better. Um, you're gonna block that. Priscilla's gonna run back. You have to kill one of them. Just to keep our chances up? I don't, I don't know. I, I, I don't freaking know. I don't, I don't, I don't freaking know. I don't freaking know. I don't, I don't, I don't freaking know. I don't freaking know. I don't freaking know. I also messed that up. I think I messed up that turn there, but that's okay. Priscilla's gotta run back. She's gonna have to help rescue some of those guys. Um, Florina, you just gotta hold this. You can throw javelins at him if you want. It's okay if you don't hit him. I don't know what's happening down here. I should have played this a bit better, too. That's not bad. I think Will can kill that. Yeah, he definitely can. There you go. He's the only guy looking at him. Perfect. And Matthew's going to come running up because he's going to steal back that. Oh, there's so many of them. Oh, man. The spawns don't stop coming and they 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 don't stop coming. I should have healed there, which was my mistake. But it's a good thing I restarted here. 
So I can have Priscilla quickly run up to heal him. Florina flies up to block this so he can't get out. And I have Ken just run in and start attacking these guys. Go in with the Iron Axe this time, because now they will die when you attack them. That was, the, that was the reason why I did that. And you throw a Hand Axe. Oh, I end a res? That's sick. Oh, I thought I ended my turn there. Oh, man. I thought I ended my turn by accident. I was like, no! No, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> Shoot. Okay, you gotta come down again. And you gotta come over. You are just going to throw that javelin at him. And Will's gonna drop back as far as he can. I think that's, that's the play I should have made last turn. Because now these guys are gonna attack him and he gets to get a couple swings back on them. And luckily she doesn't kill him, so that guy can't shoot her because he's in the way. Oh, he's not holding his hand axe. Stupid me. I'm a stupid idiot. Stupid idiot. I remember Raven said to Lucius, wait for me. So he's waiting for her. Anyway. Good hit. Good hit. Can Will get there? Yeah, he can. Yeah, he can. <laughs> That's not bad. I'll take that. So you're going to quickly mend Rebecca. I don't want to let that guy out. What am I doing? You're going to smack that man, and you're going to smack this man. Yeah, work on that axe rating. What are you at? D? Heck yeah. <laughs> We're going to rescue one. We have to rescue as many of them as we can. Rebecca's going to be here to rescue one as well. Is anybody here? Yeah, you do. That's it. Look how big this map is. I do like that FE7 will touch on, like, bigger maps. You know, just, like, slightly, slightly larger concepts. Stop picking on them. I don't like it. Oh, thank God that last guy didn't double. Oh. That would have been bad, that would have been bad now, yeah, it would have been bad, it would have been bad, yeah, it would have been. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to have, you can't rescue, of course, of course not. So you're going to just start running back. I'm going to have Priscilla do like a rescue and step forward dealio. Raven's got to go get him. Hector's going to be nearby. To help with the collection of the enemy. Of the... Not the enemy. You know what I mean. Um, you're going to back up. Because I'm actually okay with what's going on up here. What I'm not okay with is what's going on down here. Because you are dying. My friend. Bro. You are nearly dead. Bro, you are on the verge of death right now. There is a Volnery in there. But at what cost? Because I would like if we could kill and block anybody else from attacking you at least. So we can at least do that. You're fairly safe. Right? How far can you move? Seven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, you can't even get, it, get to him. So you're going to run all the way back and keep yourself safe behind that. Or do I move? Right, can I move to a spot? Yeah. If you move to right there, only one of them can attack you if you move right there. And I'm okay with one of them attacking you, because you're at full health. Okay, let's see what happens. I'm worried. There's a lot of dudes down here. 
That was good. That was a good fight. It was a good fight. That was a bad level up, but it was a good fight. I didn't do anything. Yay, a level up for Rebecca. That's pretty good. It's a pretty good one, too. Oh, they're both going for Merlinus. Okay. I figured that would be more important to them. I don't want him to die, though. That's my problem. And I just wish... You're holding... You're not even holding a Volnery, man. there they're all just going to attack you though like you're screwed Bart I thought you were going to be useful down here apparently you were not I'm going to swing that back because I think I could have handled this whole bottom area a lot better because I would like if you could attack him at close range so now theoretically all of them should go for him I'm going to try to move Bart back a little more strategically this time. And Will is still going to hang back. And Matthew is going to start running. My animations are off, right? Yep, okay. You attack him. We're also working on getting slightly different Hector level ups on this fight right here. We also got to make sure we heal Kent first, because that helps a ton. It'd be cool if you could go for this instead. How many, what level to get on that? I'll take the strength, skill, speed all day. All day and every single day. I will take that. I haven't kept Sarah and Hector standing next to each other much, have I? We can do that a bit later in the turn. In the battle. That was a good level. That's a much better level up. some experience doing that. It's funny. So what I would like to do is if I can do that. And then Bart can just move just out of his range. And Matthew will be there in a sec. So okay, we've taken over this bottom part of the map fairly well, honestly. Oh, I guess that kill with the last use of that javelin. It's really good, actually. And then you leave that guy with low health for Bart to kill. Spawns again and two more down there. There's just so many of them. Sarah again is going to run up. Do a quick heal. Get that shot. Get that level up. Sarah, give me something good. Level 13. Skill, luck. Res is what I expect of you to get, to be honest. You have a very high max luck. Which is kind of 
hilarious. Oh, no, no, drop. Just stand there. Just stand there. Raven's gonna go off and get Lucius. has to start attacking close range. So he'll just use his iron sword, his iron lance for now. Because he will still attract some attention down there. Matthew's gonna help there for a minute. Oh no. Oh he, he should be okay, actually. Should be okay. Ah dude, Clea. Yeah, just barely. Rebecca was okay. No more spawns. No more spawns. One more archer, but that's it. Here we go. Hey, look, it's Lucius. We got Lucius back. And I'm actually going to use Lucius for a bit. We got Lucius back. From the Lin mode, remember? I like that uh, his return is very kind of like, oh, he, he's back. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, you're just like, oh, all right. Oh, okay, cool. I gotta set his for solo. I'm gonna use him a bit. Raven's is gonna be on. So we're not using Raven on this one. Um, we will use Lucius a little bit because I want to get the magic version of the next map. Or one of the next maps. Or one of them. There's a there's a point in the game as well where there's two different splits based on which units are higher level, either your mages or your physical units. It's based on like mages, monks, and troubadours, I think. And maybe shamans, but there's only one shaman, so I doubt it's the shamans. But um, if Sarah goes there, he's going to get attacked by that guy. So strength 10 plus 16. You have 21 HP, so you will survive. There's no way you're getting doubled, because you have 13 speed. So you're going to heal Rebecca. In fact, you will even mend Rebecca to... You will meal Rebecca. <laughs> That's when you use recover. Recover. Macover. Anyway. Um, and you just hit that for 92%. He would kill you if he, if he two-shot you, because he had higher strength by one i guess but you got it there we go and it's just that's the majority of the enemies on this map actually you're gonna stab that man and bart's gonna try and clean it up a little bit can he get that oh you better hit that you better hit that yeah so because these horses are actually done, I can finally send Matthew all the way up. And Will can start following that, although he will not get there anytime soon. And hopefully there's no more archers coming out. Come on, Bart. And then even if the other guy attacks from behind, that's okay. Yeah, 12 damage. Nope. Yeah, with 13 speed, I didn't think I didn't think she was gonna get hit. She didn't have the skill to back it up. Eh, there goes the timer. We're doing pretty good, actually. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Come on, Lucius! Come on, Lucius! Let's go! Come on, Lucius, let's go. Come on, Lucius, let's go. Whoa. Come on, Lucius, let's go. Oh, come on, Lucius, let's go. Give Sarah some experience here. 
That's part of why I'm using Sarah and maybe a bit of Lucius, honestly. Just for that purpose. Yeah, she stands right there. It'd be better if she stood right there. Because I didn't have a hard part. Hard time reaching you. Hard time finding angles. You double? Oh, I was hoping you would double, but you didn't. Good job, Bart. I'm proud of you. I'm very proud of you. I don't even let you hurt him a little bit. Crush my mid-range a little bit so I come out a little bit louder when I talk over the music. Um... Just turning up my base. Um Alright, yeah, just keep on running guys. Just keep on working on it. Just keep on finding your way through. Um, how's my sound? Do I need a little bit more of a mid hump? Yeah. Um yeah, you can just wait there, I guess. You can take a step, two steps back, I guess, if you want. Yeah, and then Raven's gonna work his way back out of here. I think we're doing good. I'm hoping I can get Lucius to attack that archer, to be honest. Well, at least you gave, at least you gave Will a kill. You gave Will the kill. You just gotta give Will the kill. Oh no. There's no way you're getting doubled though, so you're okay. That's alright. Oh, perfect. You put yourself in range, you idiot. Oh! <laughs> okay, Rebecca, way to show off. Way to show off on that one. <laughs> it was pretty sick, actually. Lucius, if you throw a lightning at him, he will die, and you will double. So, let's watch it. It's been a while since we've watched Lucius attack, and he gets a level up for this, so it'd be kind of, kind of, kind of awesome. It's funny, in my Elliewood hard mode, I'm not using Urk like at all, because I didn't use Lin mode. I'm trying to avoid Lin mode units. And in this mode, I just didn't end up using Urk too much, so <laughs> it's just kind of like, screw Urk, man useless. Okay, that's all that's the majority of the enemies dealt with. Kent can take that and run away. And Hector can be like, whoa, don't attack Florina like that. Bro, what did I say about attacking Florina? You didn't hear me say anything because you couldn't hear me. <laughs> oh, man. Love this game. Just hold that, at least you don't take any damage, right? And you're only at one. Does anyone need a heal? You're at full health, right? Yeah, okay. So you can do your heal on Hector, I guess. I just want to get Sarah a bunch of experience. Because she is worth it. Okay, and everyone else is going to run back. Sarah's going to come heal them at some point. Seems like we really only can get one chapter done at a time when I do these videos, but that's, you know what? Honestly, it's okay with me. It'd be cool if I can get Lucius there, actually. So let's try to get Lucius there. Well, if you did, I thought it'd be really cool if you could, but apparently you can. And no one can take that. I'm 
willing to let somebody get attacked just so I can get more heals off, honestly. I was hoping I could get Lucius as close as I could, but unfortunately I couldn't. And you guys just gotta keep on moving. Look, it's a pretty safe place to keep that knight locked anyway, for Lucius to get the kill. Why would you stand right there? What's your speed? Two. How much damage are you taking? It was 16 total? Javelin does six. Yeah, 16 total. You can stand there if you want and get that free XP. Because you can't, you can't get there. I was hoping you could, but... I want you to trade with Matthew. Take his killing edge for now. We'll just sell it later. We're not going to use it. Let Sarah get more heals. I'm going to say something very um, rude of me, but Sarah's got some hips. Um, anyway. <laughs> just being weird. Um, okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's play Pokemon. Let's go. Pikachu, any version for the Nintendo Switch? I could have moved Osman, but it didn't really matter. I did that just so he could get healed. Um, I'm even going to let Lucius get this kill. Oh! I knew it. I knew it was going to be a crit somehow. It just feels good. And you love how those first few like frames, you're like, oh, it's happening. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Kalen Knight. Here, get healed. You're welcome. Oh, I thought you got the thing. All right, never mind. Never mind. You're gonna run there, and you're gonna you can support with somebody. I'll let him do the support if he wants. Impact him. Good day, young master. How fare you? Oh, Matthew. I've heard you're quite strong, you know. But if there's anything I can do to help, don't hesitate to ask. Just say the word, and I'll swipe healing bombs from every enemy. I might just ask for that later on, actually. Yeah. In fact, in, in, in fact, it'd be cool if you could take that knight's crest off that guy, and that's how he gets the C rank. Um, that guy's got magic, but we can draw his attention, I guess. Draw his attention there. Just want to be an exact range away so that he attacks from a range so Rebecca can attack back. So he can't attack back. Oh, he can talk to him. Is everyone well? Commander Kent, you're safe. Can you fight? Of course, sir. Then let's drive these knaves out of Castle Kalen. Yes, sir! Which is... You don't want him to do the fighting, so I don't know why they had that conversation. That was very bad advice. I don't know why they did that. Um, these guys are working their way up there just so that they can get healed, and Oswin theoretically doesn't need it because he doesn't take any damage. <laughs> I could have moved Florina out of there, but it's okay. Ow. Ow. Wanted to get their attention, and Rebecca's good for baiting and like that. She's got decent res, doesn't she? No! <laughs> no! Why did you do that? You idiot! You friggin' idiot! Why? Why did he do that? Well, you know what, guys? I'm just gonna have to disappear for a sec. And I'll get back to where I was. That was the... Oh my god, I'm so mad. I am so <laughs> mad. I am so mad. Oh, jeez. It's the worst. It's actually disgusting. It's the saddest thing. And I've done that so many times. I've done that many times. Oh my god. I do declare we're about back to where we were. I still have to move everybody around. Uh, Matthew still has to go back. Um... So I have to do this. The screen's back on. I just want to make sure the screen was still going. Um, 
Okay, I, I decided to put Priscilla here to block the thief. The thief doesn't attack, even if the attack is completely safe, because he'd be attacking a healer. Um, I'm gonna have Lucius take out the knight, though. Because I can do that. I can have Lucius take out the knight through the... Uh, through just not activating him yet. I didn't get him trapped like I did last time. Um, which doesn't really matter. But now, what I'm going to do is just wait with these guys, I guess. Now that guy's going to be a problem, but we'll deal with it in a sec. I've already dealt with all the reinforcements. Matthew's on his way up. Florina's going to come down, trade with him, take his killing edge off his hands just so he can steal. Nobody needs heals, do they? Kent probably does. Kent can get his attention if we want to... Oh, we don't want to do that yet. So Kent, just go right there. I'm going to run you all the way back to pick up Lucius, I think. And you're going to run there and... Oops, rescued the wrong person. That's not good. That's not... Not good. He's doing it again. He did it. He friggin' did it again. Because he picked up the wrong person. Oh my god. Take. Drop. He can pick up Kent. I mean, I guess that makes sense. It's Hector. There you go. <laughs> that was the turn I was supposed to do. I nearly made the same <laughs> mistake again. Oh, that would have been lit it would have been tragic. It would have been actually tragic, mate. Actually bloody tragic. I'd be flabbergasted, mate. Flabbergasted. And now Priscilla's gonna get attacked. But that's okay. You guys are done down here, so you can start all moving back. That activates him, but that's okay, because we can keep him, like, trapped behind a wall now. Priscilla's gonna stay in there. Does anybody need heals? Anybody? Raven does. Raven will need more heals after that, too. Good thing I brought Florina, actually, because she ended up being mildly useful, even though she's still level 4. <laughs> so now, theoretically, if you steal this Knight's Crest, because he grabbed the sword first... Oh, I still don't get the sword. So it didn't matter. <laughs> None of it bloody mattered at all. After all that work, I think I did that on the on the original playthrough too, and I do it like every time I play through this game. Luckily, it didn't matter at all. And like they say in Sonic's theme, oh, it doesn't matter how it happens. It does matter how it happens, because I wanted Lucius to get that kill, man. <laughs> Why? Now Lucius has to kill the thief to get this level up that he's been waiting for. Well, it's better level up, I guess. I don't remember what he got last time, but I'll take it. I should probably get an extra heal here on Raven. I moved him farther away, even though he's at full health now, just because you'll understand in a sec. So all you guys gotta get here to get healed by Sarah. Um, okay. Here we go. Let's finish this map. Bernard's been in the top corner of this map the whole time. We're gonna have Rebecca draw this guy's ire. By standing right there. Lucius is gonna be nearby to hopefully clean up as well. Will's gonna start coming down. Raymond's gonna go back. Sarah's gonna heal.
Oh, you guys are good. Let's turn animations on. And let's watch how this fight unfolds. It's good. We can heal that. And seven damage. Good shot, Rebecca. Good job. So you would die if you get hit again, but you don't kill him if you hit him, which is very notable. More heals for Sarah. guy but without killing him. That'll be seven times two. So he definitely doesn't. Yep. Ow. I'm just glad I didn't get a crit, which was the only thing that mattered there. And then we'll let Lucius clean it up. Oh, I meant to turn on his animations, but that's okay. Another level up. Wow. Already level six. Skill and a res. Wow, we're gonna have like, you know what though? Res in this mode, actually good. And you're gonna see, you're gonna see how it matters. Where's Lucius? So we are gonna use Lucius right now. Um, okay, so it's just those guys left. Kent's gonna go running in, holding that heavy spear he's been holding on to all game. Whoops. Good thing he doesn't die. <laughs> would have been so sad. It would have been tragic, man. Oh, I didn't even realize that, Javelins. I should have checked before I went charging into this room. I don't even think about it sometimes. Um, Matt, run back. Twenty damage. Nope. Figured you'd definitely kill him, so. It'd be nice if I can get Lucius one of these kills, because he can get there. How much damage does he do? 10, so he just needs to do 4 damage total. And since your attack speed is nothing right now, I can even use that Silver Axe just once, just to show off. Knock him down to 6. That's good damage. Because he's carrying someone, his speed is severely dropped as well. That's what carrying somebody does. You can see, actually, if you look at his stats, you see it shows how they've dropped because he's carrying somebody. Um, yeah, so we're just going to shoot this guy. 10 damage. Good job, Lucius. Let's see if we can get the kill, too. All right. But well, that's everybody healed. Sarah's gonna start coming back. I gotta bring her back up as fast as I can. Because we're sneaking up on that guiding ring really fast, actually. That guiding ring's coming up. I know how I'm gonna fight that boss, but I just gotta get there. So you're going to come running all the way up. You're going to take drop strats. We're going to have her heal everybody in a nice little orderly line here. So everyone except Hector will get a heal. And then we'll worry about taking on the boss. I know we're going to waste a bunch of turns here, but I like getting as much experience as possible with my healers. Because their experience isn't tied to number of enemies, right? So their experience is literally free, so long as you make, a, make it a point so that somebody is always missing life. You know what I mean? Because experience is based on the staff they use. It's not based on anything else actually. I would like it if Hector would stand next to Sarah while this is all happening. Just because I think that is thematically 
Hold on, Logan. Matthew again. Matthew can run back now. He doesn't need to really be anywhere. And then you heal Lucius. And now it's time to actually take on Bernard. Bernard himself. Uh, none of you guys can help. You guys could could have helped, but I've left you down here so long that you're just not helping now. Sorry, guys. Here we go. All right. Create this restore point. This way we don't have to restart the whole mission just to redo it. Go in, Silver Axe. You do double. You do 11 damage total. So you're going to knock him down to 10, assuming you hit both attacks. So let's go. I am Bernard, Knight Commander of Laos. I will test the might of those who bested Barker. You're a Barker. <laughs> oh, man, that's sick. That fight's already over. Because how much damage does Lucius do? Nothing. <laughs> uh, no damage. <laughs> I don't want Raven to get the kill either. Um, Kent, how far are you? Oh, you're about to level up, Kent. I'm going to let you get it. Just because you got this hammer and it was like a story of the episode, you're going to use it. It was more likely to hit than the other thing anyway. This is just a reward for life's brutality. Because that'll give him a ton of experience despite being classed up, which is pretty good. I mean, I'll take the skill. The fact that he's getting, like, crazy skill, he's going to be, like, crit city, man. And I believe everyone is at full health now. So I should just be able to end next turn. Units. This is a great way to check all your HPs. Yep. End that turn. Have Sarah next stand next to him for a sec. It doesn't matter just to check. Do, da, 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 da. Grandfather, grandfather, where? Lord Housen, where are you? Elliewood, here on the throne. It's blood. Blood? It can't. No, it can't be. Lindis, calm down. He might only be injured. Come, let us find him. Yes, you're right. I must be calm. There, over there, there's somebody. Who's there? Show yourself. <gasps> you. Layla. Yes, it's me, Lord Hector. It's been a long time. You know her? Yes, her name's Leela. She works for Ostia. All right. She's a spy. Lord Elliewood of Fairy and Lady Lindis of Kaelin, correct? I am Leela, pleased to make your acquaintance. Lady Lindis, Marcus Kaelin is back there receiving treatment. My grandfather is safe? His life is yet his own. Ah, Father Sky and Mother Earth, I thank you for your mercy. Leela, what are you doing here? I... I'm following Lord Uther's orders. I'm investigating Marcus Ferre's disappearance. My father, what have you learned? Come with me, we should talk in private. Because the Black Fang might be watching. Huh? Come on, Elliewood. Ah. Worrying about things won't change them. I know. Let me start with my conclusion. Marcus Ferre is alive. Woo, Elliewood, let's go! That's wonderful. Are you sure? I've been posing as a member of the Black Fang for several months. That's where I got this information. I believe it is true. Black Fang, they're the Assassin's Guild that Eric spoke of. Yes, we've known of their, we've known of their existence for quite some time. Explain. Black Fang is a guild of assassins founded about 10 years ago by Brendan Reed. They're based in Bern. Their arms, reach, their arms reached quickly in several other countries. Originally, they targeted only nobles who abused their positions. The masses saw them as chivalrous, defenders of the common man. Their activities found wide support. Chivalrous? Then, about a year ago, Brendan got married again. Black Fang's operations have slowly changed since then. 
Now they'll take on any target, no matter how difficult, as long as they're paid. And they're no longer killing only criminals. Anyone is a fair target. Is this Black Fang responsible for what's happened to my grandfather? Yes. We've learned of a, mis mis of a mystery man named Nurgle behind, behind Reed's wife. It seems that Black Fang is performing secret tasks across Lycia for Nurgle. Nurgle's trusted retainer, Ephidel, is with Marcus Laus. He manipulated Laus into hatching the rebellion plot against Ostia. The first answer Laus's call for rebellion was... Marcus Santa Ruse. Lord Hellman, why would you... Next was Lord Elbert, Marcus Ferry. You're telling me that my father endorsed this plan? I can't say. I do know that he is with Marcus Laus currently, in a place called the Dragon's Gate. Dragon's Gate? Where is that? On an island called Valor, off the southern coast of Lycia. Apo I apologize, but that is all the information I have. Of all places to be, Valor? Blast. What kind of place is it? It's said that those who step onto the island never return. The common folk call it the Dread Isle. If that's where my father is, however, I will go and find him. In this Dragon's Gate, too. I'm going with you. I'll tell you right now, you can't stop me. I'm also going. Lindis, I appreciate your kindness, but shouldn't you stay with Marcus Kalen? Laos must be stopped, otherwise they might target my grandfather again. I also wish to help Elliewood's father. Losing a parent is an unbearable pain. It's something I'd rather didn't have to feel yet. Is that you, Layla? I skipped the rest of that cutscene. Matthew, it's been a long time. What have you been doing? So they kind of flirt for a sec, although you never get Layla on your team, which is very sad. To rescue Marcus Ferry. If things go well, I'll be in Austria at the same time you are. Is that so? You need to visit my hometown. Is this where you were born? Why? Well, I had uh, to, to meet my parents. Hmm. Matthew. What, but, <laughs> well, that's that. See you later. That's slippery as ever. That's, I love that. <laughs> That's how he rolls up. He's just like, oh, well, I'm so stuck to you later. Everyone, I'll be... Anyway, they're all just being like, oh, it's, it's our queen. You get a red gem based on the people you saved. Sweet, you get a red gem. Oh, wow. So if you only save one person, you get a mine. So I only have one mine. Um, which is concerning, because I actually like having two. But if I only have one... Oh, you do get a third one. If you save one, you get one. If you save two, you probably get like another item, and you save three, you get a red gem. So we got a red gem. I actually kind of wish I only saved one, but regardless, next time we're going to be taking on a side quest because we're going to be figuring out how we're going to take a boat to get to that dread isle they were talking about, and the place they're going to go next. They said it in the story, but I skipped over it. They're going to the port of Badon. So that's about that for today's episode. Thank you everyone for watching. I'm sure that was a long one in the end. I had to edit it a bit. I'm sure I'm going to have to edit it a bit. But thank you everyone so much for watching. Next time on Fire Emblem, we're going to be taking on that bonus chapter. I always go to the support conversation. I want to put music on. Um, I just want to quickly put on. And that's what we're going to be doing next time on Fire Emblem 7. I'll probably record tomorrow before I head out for work. So that's my plan. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.